Hi, how are you all doing? I'm Diego Aguinzaga, an engineer at Forza Laser, and today I'm pleased to introduce you to one of our most anticipated machines, the new Forza Solder. This beautiful machine doesn't just weld, it can also cut and clean. In fact, it's a 4-in-1, but we'll get into that later. Let's start with the basic principle of how laser welding works. Unlike conventional welding processes like TIG, MIG, or stick welding, which use heat generated by an electric arc to melt the material, in laser welding what we use is a beam, a powerful enough ray of light that melts the material. This operating principle is extremely important. Unlike conventional welding processes that require meticulous control of the electric arc to achieve a good weld bead, in laser welding those micro-explosions, let's call them that, are eliminated, and this gives us the following advantages. First, lighter protection. Unlike conventional processes that require a protective helmet, which is usually heavy and really limits your vision, because traditional welding processes generate a lot of sparks. With laser welding, we don't have that. We just use glasses that protect us from the light. Second, there are no stop cycles. This machine can work 24 seven without any kind of pause. It has a chiller cooling system that keeps the temperature constant. No matter how long we're working, unlike conventional processes where some welds need to pause to cool down. Third, ease of use. And this really is a revolutionary feature. Up until now, welding processes required a highly experienced professional welder. That's because maintaining the electric arc in a standard welding process is a bit tricky. If the gun or electrode gets too close, the material sticks together, or if we move it too far away, the electric arc fades and we lose the weld bead. Also, if the amperage is set incorrectly, we can end up making a hole in the material. These kinds of issues don't happen with laser welding, because here we don't rely on distance to maintain that electric arc. Here, it's the light that melts the material, and that light will keep coming out no matter if it's a little farther or closer to the material. This makes welding incredibly easy, to the point that anyone can be trained in just 15 minutes. 4. Better control over the width of the weld bead. The laser has a system of galvanometric mirrors that allow me to control the light beam and, well, to manage and adjust the width of the weld bead. This is usually quite complicated in other processes. Because of the micro-explosions and the addition of welding material, we get variations in the weld bead. Here, we can adjust it however we like, whether for thin materials or for thick ones. Now let's take a look at the parts of our Forza solder. Let's start with the gun, which features a feeding system for the filler material, an adjustable tip at the end, so we can screw on the nozzle depending on the type of job, uh, or also the type of welding, whether it's internal or external, a hatch that lets us swap out the lenses depending on the operation, and, well, an internal mirror system. All of this is connected to a cooling system and a shielding gas supply. The gas comes out through the tip together with the laser. The laser travels from the source through this hose here. Inside the machine, we find the laser source. This is the resonator that generates the beam of light, which allows us to carry out welding, cutting, or cleaning processes. Here we also have the chiller, or cooling system. It's responsible for maintaining the ideal working temperature for the laser source, and it operates with distilled water. The laser has the particular requirement of needing the right temperature and also a constant voltage system. That's why this equipment also includes a voltage regulation system, which allows me to eliminate spikes and always maintain a constant voltage. A pretty simple control. First, there are buttons that let me turn on the machine and the laser source, and a touch controller that, first of all, is in Spanish and also lets me save work profiles. That way, if I want to weld a material, I just select the type of material, the thickness, and that's it, the machine configures itself automatically. I don't even need to take off my gloves to operate it. 
And finally, an automatic feeding system. This system allows me to adjust the feed speed of the material for the weld bead. I can adjust it depending on the type of bead I need, and it works in sync with the gun. Now let's talk about some special features of the Forza solder. You can order it with a laser power of 1500, 2000, or 3000 watts. The 1500 or 2000 watt configurations operate with a 220 volt single phase power supply, while the 3000 watt version requires 220 volt three phase power. Additionally, the welding can be done with or without filler material. We can make the weld beads either intermittent or continuous. The machine has the capability to set this up automatically. It also allows me to save welding profiles so I only need to select the material and thickness, and everything else is set up automatically. The control for adding filler material is synchronized with the torch and works automatically. Additionally, changing the nozzles is very simple and I don't need any special tools. The torch, unlike with other welding systems, is actually quite lightweight, and the software is very intuitive, with very few buttons, but enough to control the entire machine. And the essential thing, the main thing, something I love, is that it's a 4-in-1 machine. This machine can weld, it can cut, it can do a quick cleaning process for rusty parts, and it can also clean small weld beads. And of course, we're going to talk about the consumables that this Forza solder needs to operate. First, a shielding gas. Generally, argon, nitrogen, or even helium is used. Here we have a cryogenic nitrogen tank that stores liquid nitrogen and converts it into gaseous nitrogen. This gives us, well, a high-quality nitrogen, a class 5 type, which is ideal for the welding processes we're going to be working with. Additionally, as a consumable, we also have the wire or filler material, which depends on the material we're going to work with, whether it's stainless steel, aluminum, or carbon steel, we'll select the appropriate filler material. The nozzles aren't really a consumable as such, since they don't wear out depending on the hours of use. Rather, they're protectors for the torch, and they also help guide our weld beads. We only replace them depending on the amount of damage the nozzles have sustained. The thicknesses this machine can work with are related to the power setting we choose. When the Forza solder is equipped with 3000 watts, it can weld up to 6 millimeters of mild steel. Here I'll leave you a little table where you can see the different thicknesses for each material, corresponding to each power level and operation. So, what are the ideal applications for the Forza solder? First of all, if we are indeed looking for a truly clean and aesthetically pleasing weld bead, and perhaps the bead produced from traditional stick welding or even MIG welding simply doesn't quite meet our exacting standards, then we will undoubtedly achieve a significantly much cleaner and more refined bead with the advanced process of laser welding. Additionally, if we have a very delicate process with a special material like aluminum or stainless steel, we'll have much less contamination with the laser welding process. And finally, if we're looking for energy efficiency and also to reduce our operating costs. Contrary to what people think, the costs of operating a laser machine are much lower than with a MIG or TIG process. So why should we choose a laser welding machine over conventional MIG or TIG processes? Contrary to popular belief, laser welding offers some advantages or benefits, lower operating costs, better finish quality, greater ease of use. It's true that the initial price of the machine is higher than the other two processes, but in terms of operating costs, it's much lower, so we can easily recover our investment within a year. And that's everything regarding this beautiful machine. I'm sure that if you work with steel, you'll fall in love with it just like we did, especially because of its four functions, watching it weld, watching it cut, watching it clean. It's truly a spectacle. Laser technology can't be compared to any of the conventional processes we know. If you want to see more videos of this beautiful machine, want to see it cutting or welding some materials, 
or even some challenges we're going to do, subscribe. Also, leave us any questions you have in the comments, and well, we'll see you in the next video. Bye, bye.